you come to the conclusion yourself, just a warning, this is probably the most extra <laughs> thrift haul try on you've ever seen. Like, yeah, I'm pretty sure it is because it's the most extra that I've seen. So, um, enjoy and, um, yeah. Yep, that's what she said. Every time I come around, she acting shy. She be hey guys, it's Crystal O, and today I'm going to be doing a massive thrift try on haul. So I went thrifting like two weeks ago and I spent about 100 to 110, 20 dollars on thrifted items that I thought were really cute. This is actually a thrifted piece. Um, but anyways, I'm going to be showing you guys my outfits. As you can see from my intro, I was dancing way too much and I was super awkward, which I love, <laughs> and super just random, which is like so me. So I won't be stopping and talking, but instead I'm going to just add my voice into um, the parts where I'm showing the outfit so you guys can understand more about it, understand how much it costs, and like kind of learn about like the details or kind of what I think or what I'm feeling about the outfit so um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you do make sure you give it a thumbs up subscribe comment below and I will see you guys at the end of the video oh and also so my style is more so like vintagey very retro chic bohemian I don't know I just have a mix of styles so you're gonna see like styles ranging from a modern minimalist look maybe or to a vintage very retro very vogue chic you know style so don't be surprised i promise you i intentionally did that i cannot make up my mind on what my style actually is so if you know it and you see it in this video comment below and let me know what it is because your girl is everywhere okay all around the world we be all around the world. That's how my style literally is. It is all around the world. So, hope you guys enjoy this video, and I will see you guys at the end. So, here we have our first look, and this top is basically giving me bandana meets vintage blouse, which is so cute. I got this top for $2 and these high waisted jeans for $3. I love high waisted jeans because they give me such a snatched look, and I'm so here for it. So here for it. So I'm going to go ahead and roll these sleeves up and bam, work, 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 work. Yep, that's what so let's say I'm going for a more bohemian look. These pants were not thrifted, but just showing you what they would look like with high-waisted pants. You better work, girl. So I got this hat at the thrift store for like a dollar and it came with this little bow thing on it. Wasn't really feeling it, so I let that go and look at that. You better, little Bo Peep. Is that what they call her? I think that's what they call her. But you better work, girl. You better work. You better work, girl. You better work. Wait. Cut up, 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 cut up. Yep, that's what. So this look is basically serving I'm a child of God. And if you don't know my worth, please step aside. So I got this top for about $2. And I also thrifted these Levi jeans for two bucks as well. It's super cute, such a cute pair together, and I think it just looks so bright and sunshiny. And it's such a fall look and a spring look as well. So definitely a keeper, definitely loving it, and yeah. Now I'm just going to show you my Naomi Campbell walk, since y'all in the back might not be able to see it from where you're seated, so. <laughs> as you can see, my knees are clearly living their best lives. Yep, that's what so this outfit is taking me all the way back. It is giving me cheetah girl, cheetah sister vibes. Like, you better work, girl. You better praise the Lord with them hips. So I'm going to tuck it in on one side just to see how that would look. And I mean, it's not bad, but I definitely prefer it both tucked in. This is what it looks like when the Lord has been good and is shining upon you. And the glow is just too much. Just got to praise him. And just uh, drop them. Yes. And by the way, this top was $3. So I'm going to go ahead and start layering with jackets. This jacket was 10 bucks at the thrift. Um, some would say it's a little pricey for 10 bucks, but honestly, it's really cute. So I was not tripping for the price. Really great quality. And it just looks so good on this print. So what I really liked about this top was that 
It has a very soft feel. It's kind of leathery. It's very, very, very comfortable, very folly, um, and just cute, honestly. I do love that it has this really cute pattern on the front. It's very tribal, I would say, I, I think, <laughs> but um, and then on the sides, it's very smooth. So I thought that was really cute, just to give it some more detail and design. So on to jacket number two that I'm gonna be showing you guys. This jacket was purchased at the thrift for $5, and I think it's a very, very cute, subtle, more calm toned jacket. I think it's very flattering. Um, I do prefer the red one when it comes to, I guess, preference, but they're both really cute. They both look good layered as well. So very cute, very soft. It has a very sleek look. I love how the leather feels very, very smooth and soft and just a comfy jacket. Yep, that's what this top right here is giving me black and white checkerboard. <laughs> I think it's so artsy and I just loved um, how long it is. It does have pockets, so we bless God because, you know, pockets are a girl's best friend. Um, I think it's cute. I think it's a cute top, just a cute laid back, minimal, you know, easily styled top that is pretty cute. Your girl got this blouse at the thrift for $6. So as you can see, your girl can't complain. I am not mad. Mad where? Mad for what? Mad for why? <laughs> so I think I prefer this top tucked in because it's just cute. And I also rolled up the sleeves just to see how it would look. And I also prefer that as well. This is a really cute um, top to layer. And I look forward to playing around with it in the future. Yep, that's what so this top was not thrifted, but these pants were as seen in previous clips. I got this really cute velvety jacket from the thrift for $3. And y'all, this is actually one of my favorite jackets as of now. I feel like I've worn it like a hundred billion times since I bought it. I love just um, the color. It's so vibrant and rich. I love the texture of it. And um, yeah, it's cute in a variety of styles, like rolled up, you know, tucked in you know buttoned up or whatever i just think it's a really really cute look all together i feel like it can be styled with so many different things and i just think it's really cute like i feel like i want to go put it on right now honestly but um yeah it's just a really cute top so i'm gonna go ahead and toss on another jacket while i'm at it this is a bomber jacket that i found at the thrift store for ten dollars it's actually originally from forever 21 i just felt like i mean i might as well buy it since it is you know cheaper it basically looks like barely used and worn so i was like count me in i will take it i tried to see what it looked like zipped up and y'all i looked like the struggle like it's just not cute zipped up like so it's a no for me dog it's a no Yep, that's what so I present to you your fairy godmother. <laughs> y'all, I'm a joke. But y'all, this poncho is adorable. I got it for six bucks. It's so cute, so folly, so comfortable. And like, did I say comfortable? Yep, that's what so this vest was a hit or miss. I found this in the men's section for $2.50. I think that honestly, it's worth working with. I thought it came together pretty good. I got this in a size X large. So, you know, I was a little suspicious if it would look right or not, but I think it looks good. I think it could definitely be a look. I was shook because this mug does not have pockets, y'all. I was so mad, like, what do you mean? But the buttons are really cute. And as you can see, I'm just gonna be cutting carrots in this vest. Yep, that's what so this skirt was purchased for $4 and I really like it. Once again, it is velvety. I do think that I'm going to end up cutting it, but I'm just going to go ahead and style it with this jacket that I got for $5 at the thrift. Really love this jacket as well. So cute. I'll show you guys the details in a second. So I'm going to go ahead and roll it up real quick just to see how that looks. And I mean, I like the outfit together somewhat. It's not terrible, but it could be cuter, I think. So I'm going to go ahead and try to roll the skirt up to see if I can gain some, you know, a little less length to make it look a little better and a little more chic. And I like it. I really like it. I think it's really cute. So the plan will eventually be to cut the skirt in the future. But for now, this is a cute look. So let's get into these details on the suit. Honestly, y'all, I just love it. I really don't even know what to say about this, but yeah, love it. 
Yep, that's what. This outfit right here is giving me Dora the Explorer goes to Nigeria. Enugu, Nigeria. Yes. So I'm going to do a pause break right now so you guys can just see how awkward I am in real life. So enjoy. Stiff wear. Kind of stiff everywhere because I haven't washed my hair in a little bit. So pardon me. But yeah, this is me in real life. Yep. Sorry to bust your bubble. I'm not, not normal for the most part. But for the most part, this is a look, and I can get down with it. I think it would look good tied. It would look good, you know, clothes, looking kind of like a jumpsuit in a sense. So this can definitely be worked with. You just got to work with it, you know. You got to wear it. Don't let it wear you, okay? Okay? Yep, that's what so for this outfit, can we just have a moment of silence? Like, this outfit alone slays by itself. By itself. So let's get into some details. This outfit has kind of like a bishop collar. I really like it. I think it's called a bishop collar. And uh, to me, it gives off a very big, like, boss babe vibes. Like, I'm about my business. Like, don't step to me unless it's about money. Okay, cha-ching. Don't play. I don't have time. So I like this tucked in as well. It looks more like a jumpsuit tucked in which I'm like completely fine with because it's still so cute. And it's also helpful to know that if I ever, you know, by any chance got into a dance battle while out on the streets, um, you know, your girl could bust some moves in this and kind of win this battle. <laughs> so this is good news. This pantsuit was $10 and was worth every single dollar spent on it because it is so cute. So I went ahead and threw on the white top and jacket, and it's cute. I really like it. I just prefer the actual plum set because, you know, it just works so well together. So, yeah. Yep, that's what so here we have this last outfit that I'm showing you guys. I got these pants for $4 and this top for $150. I love the texture of this top. I think that the neck collar is so regal. It's so like chic, like wow, like so cute and very vintage. I also got this bag for $9 and I think it's very cute. It's very me. I love tiny bags. And then I got these boots for $7. So super cute leathery they have a zipper on both sides which is very convenient for wide foot people like me and this is what they look like okay i'll get closer so you can see them this is what they look like <laughs> Hey guys, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed my banging dance moves. Your girl was just dancing. I was just dancing as if I was in, you know, David Do's music video. <laughs> Oh Lord. Okay. But yeah, anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you are not already subscribed to my channel, make sure you subscribe for more of this crazy randomness that you saw in this video. And yeah, I think that's all I actually have to say. Oh yeah. Comment below, like, subscribe. I said that already, I think. But uh, yeah, I will see you guys next time on my channel. Bye. That's what she said. Yep. That's what she said.